Whether for-profit or non-profit, Wheeling's organizations were happy to roll up their sleeves today. Businesses gave employees a paid day off during the United Way's Day of Caring so they could offer their skills to a charitable group. 7 News reporter Colin Roos saw all the goodwill they harvested at Wheeling Island Garden. After hours of weeding, picking and carrying, these are the fruits of the United Way's labor. Wednesday was their chance to condense weeks of volunteer time into one productive day. It was a wheelbarrow full of work at the Edelman Garden on Wheeling Island where volunteers for the 32nd annual Sandy O'Haver Day of Caring picked up their gloves and trowels. The garden is owned by the city's nearly century-old Seeing Hand Association who use it as part of their job training program for the blind and visually impaired. If you were blind, you'd be facing a 70% unemployment rate. If you had a secondary disability, you'd be facing a 90% unemployment rate. So our main goal is to provide a place to come to work and help them earn a little bit of income. The nonprofit was just one of several from Brook through Tyler counties getting a head start on side projects. From Wheeling Health Right to King's Daughters to the American Red Cross, they told the United Way what they needed to have done, and the more than 150 Day of Caring volunteers were happy to oblige. Some of them are outside doing gardening, some are doing staining, painting, some are doing sorting or office work. Um, it just depends on what that specific agency needs at the time. Those needs are often ones the groups can't complete throughout the year. With some facing continuous funding and staffing challenges, they sometimes need outside volunteers to help their volunteers so they can get back to their real mission. Our workers can't do the heavy work of weeding and moving soil and moving things like wood chips. And we're so grateful that the United Way has the day of caring and they can help us do this. Now, if you want to try some of this produce for yourself, you might be able to find it in front of Seeing Hands Wheeling office, but it goes quick. Reporting in Ohio County, I'm Colin Roos, working for you. Thank you, Colin. Steven says potential volunteers tend to come on board once they see the goals of these charities and the nonprofits firsthand. You can lend your hand to the United Way 